Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today is a KS Craft Design Team package. Came rolling on in and I'm gonna jump right into it. So the first thing is this little set of donuts right here. It does come like with the layering piece. So there's the background piece and then the top piece. You could easily pop this center piece out like so. Cut this twice. And then that second piece, you can cut that piece, like trim it a little bit down the center, like cut it in half, and then you have a macaroon die as well. So that could definitely double up. The biggest little donut on this guy is about three inches, and the smallest one is a eh, an inch and a fourth maybe. So a little four piece. Next is this one right here. This says baked with love right here, and it's got the little spatula and stuff. You can make a shaker. Look at the cute little spatula, you guys. This is so cute. Goes like this. And I love the double stitching detail on this one. So cute. This bowl is about three and three fourths inches wide and about three inches tall, not including the little handle of the spatula. This is kind of like a little like um, background die, as you can see, it cuts out. Um, it looks like little tiny leaves actually, or like a flower, like a tulip kind of. This is a four by four square. Next is this little like apocryphy style jar. It comes with the lid and you can make little candies like um, swirly candies in there. You can also make it a shaker because it has that double inner layering piece. This guy probably when assembled is a little under five inches tall. Then there's this stocking die right here. It's got the little stitch detail around three different pieces of stockings, a little holly berries everywhere, the layering part for the top piece of the stocking. And you guys, just a heads up, um, Jess, who has bits, bits and pieces, oh, 91, I think, on Instagram, she, I'm not laughing at you, girl, I'm laughing with you, but she tried to make a shaker with just these two pieces. You do have to order this separate piece, um, order them both in order to create a shaker. So you can make a shaker in the biggest size, medium, and small if you buy this piece. You can't layer up what these pieces are. So you do, uh, sorry guys, I have like uh, marinade stained in my nails. So you do have to buy them together as a set if you wanna make your shaker. If you don't wanna make a shaker, just buy it like this. Next is this little set right here. You can make a little shaker sweater with this one. And this is kind of like that trend of parties. It's called an ugly sweater party, even though a lot of them are cute. But you got this sweater and then this sweater can be a shaker, the little collar, all the little decorative pieces to make it ugly the sleigh comes with a hanger a little cloak thing the sweaters are a little under three inches tall this one's a little bit shorter coming in at two and a half inches next is this one right here this is actually a cute little um like a tea bag and you can see there's different sizes so this tea bag once assembled is about two and three fourths inches tall and a little a little under two inches wide, while this one's a little bit bigger, about two and a half inches wide and three and a half inches tall. So the mama and the baby cut these out. You can actually probably cut these out in like a type of vinyl to make it like a clear shaker, or you can do the um, vellum that everybody's been doing and making cute little tea bags like that with a little sequins mix inside. And then we have this right here, these little um, stamp sentiments right here. Warm winter wishes, dear Santa, let it snow, ho, ho, ho. The most wonderful time of the year, Christmas cheer, hugs. Uh, let's see, reindeer hugs and kisses. It's the season to sparkle, yes it is. Sparkle bows and mistletoe, that's cute. Coordinating little stamps and then you can coordinate the dies as well with that. These sentiments are about anywhere from a half an inch to three fourths of an inch wide, just so you know the size of these guys. And yeah, I will catch you guys on the next crafty video. Bye guys.